A Connie Simbine showcased his sprinting prowess once again at the Oslo Diamond League, securing victory in the men's 100 meters event with a remarkable time of 9.9 for seconds. This win marked his second Diamond League triumph of the season, highlighting his consistency and strength on the track. Despite a slow start out of the blocks, Simbine powerful second half and a strategic dip at the finish line secured his place at the top of the podium. His performance overshadowed that of reigning Olympic champion Marcel Jacobs, who had to settle for fourth place, with a time of 10.03 seconds, showcasing Simbine dominance in the field. The competition in Oslo featured a stacked men's field, adding to the significance of Simbine's victory. With athletes like Abdul Hakim Sani Brown and Emmanuel Essam finishing in the top three, the event was a true test of speed and skill. Simbine's triumph not only solidified his position as a top contender but also sent a strong message to his competitors as he continues to build momentum heading towards the Paris Olympics. His win in Oslo was a statement of intent, emphasizing his readiness to challenge for a medal on the world stage. Simbine's victory in Oslo comes on the heels of a series of impressive performances throughout the season. His world-leading time of 9.90 seconds at the Adidas Atlanta City Games showcased his speed and determination, setting the stage for a successful outdoor campaign. Despite facing challenging conditions, including a headwind, Simbine's exceptional performance in Atlanta demonstrated his ability to deliver under pressure and adversity. This resilience and focus have been key factors in his consistent success this season, positioning him as a formidable force in the sprinting world. The 30-year-old South African sprinter has proven himself as a top-five sprinter globally, with notable finishes at major events such as the Rio Olympics and the World Championships. Simbine's dedication to his craft and his willingness to adapt and improve, as evidenced by recent changes to his technique, have contributed to his continued success on the track. In an exciting update, Marcel Jacobs, the 29-year-old Italian sprint sensation, is gearing up for the European Championships in Rome, set for the 7th to the 12th of June. Jacobs emphasized the significance of his recent performance. With his sights set on competing in his hometown, Jacobs is determined to be in peak condition, aiming to deliver his best performance in front of a home crowd. Jacobs' rise to fame was meteoric, capturing a surprise gold in the 100 meters at the COVID-delayed Tokyo Olympics in 2021 and adding another gold as part of Italy's 4 by 100 meters relay team. He continued his winning streak by clinching the World Indoor 60m title in Belgrade in 2020 to end the 100m title at the European Championships later that year. However, his journey has not been without challenges. A series of injuries have plagued him, prompting a move to the United States to train under renowned coach Rana Reeder. This strategic shift placed him alongside elite athletes like Canada's Olympic 200m champion Andre de Grasse and Sonny Brown. With the 2024 Olympics on the horizon, Jacobs is carefully balancing his training regimen, ensuring he doesn't push his body too hard too soon. His ultimate goal is clear, to defend his Olympic title while showcasing his prowess at the European Championships in Rome, setting the stage for an electrifying season ahead. Simbine's ability to consistently deliver strong performances, as seen in Oslo, positions him as a front-runner in the competitive world of sprinting. His strategic approach to races, combined with his natural speed and talent, have propelled him to the upper echelons of the sport. With the Paris Olympics on the horizon, Simbine's recent victories in impressive form indicate that he is a force to be reckoned with in the 100m event. As he continues to fine-tune his skills and build towards the pinnacle of his season, fans and analysts alike eagerly anticipate his future competitions and the potential for further record-breaking performances. What are your thoughts on Simbine's exceptional performance at Oslo? Share them down in the comment section below. Until then, thanks for watching, and remember to keep the sports spirit alive.